What's up, guys? So quick chat about continuing the marathon. When people say the marathon continues, it is not just a saying. It's not just a word. And it's not only in regards to the continuation of Nipsey Hussle's legacy. It's the continuation of the legacy through my legacy, through your legacy, through hard work and dedication towards the continuation and fruition and manifestation of your goals. It's not about sitting back and allowing and waiting for an MC's family to continue the legacy of other things that he's created. It's for you to continue the legacy that you created. Nipsey's crucifixion, public death, and resurrection is not just about his legacy. It's about all of us being influenced positively by the messages, by the music, by the life that he led. So that means you being working hard and being dedicated to your projects, you working hard and being dedicated to your missions, you working hard and being dedicated to your legacy as well. And it's not just about you, but it's about us together collectively resurrecting or using his resurrection to bring life into our life for more life. Otherwise, you're, you're a zombie. There's so many people out there who are just zombies going day to day, working job to job, paycheck to paycheck, and not actually living the life that they were created to live. Nipsey's resurrection, crucifixion and resurrection, was about us coming together, was about us advancing as a community, as a people. And not just black people, but people in general, people who want more light, people who want to balance the spiritual aspects of themselves and the masculine hardworking practical aspect of himself to manifest more in life to be free to be free from bondage to be free from limitations and to just basically live the life that they were created to live so when you say the marathon continues the marathon continues through you the marathon continues through me the marathon continues by us working together to manifest the desires of our heart to manifest more life and more light into the world Yes, I said his crucifixion and resurrection because that's what it symbolizes. It symbolizes a public crucifixion, a public death, and the resurrection is in our hands. It's in our ability to have life. In the Bible it says, I come so that they may have life. You may disagree with the comparison between Jesus and Nipsey, but it's basically what it is. We are light on earth. We are vessels of God on earth. And Jesus represents being a representation of God on earth, a vessel of light on earth. And even in death, even our death it should give life to others. And in his death, it gives life to you and I so that we can continue the marathon until it's over. I think that's all I have. I pulled up some cards on it. And it's basically saying the same thing. Freedom from bondage. Working hard on our goals until they manifest. Overcoming obstacles. Being blessed. Abundance and blessings. Working towards the light and a solid foundation in our life. Bringing us and moving forward on our projects. Bringing us balancing, balancing of our spiritual and material aspects. So... The marathon continues, and it continues through me and you. Peace. <laughs>